Dear Sister Teresa, David, Susan, I want to thank you for sharing your dad and your husband with the world. I know so many times he was away during special days, but there's so many special days now in millions of people's lives. He surely built that army that he spoke of. The great revival that sweeps across Africa today, the seeds of it in these last years, in this generation were sown by Dr. Morris Cirillo. I just thank God for what he has meant to me, the part he's played in my life. The day I met him, my life changed. The direction of my life changed. It's said that everybody changes the world a little bit, but Morris Cirillo changed the world a lot. Everywhere that he has been, his flavor is still on that nation. His anointing still radiates. And I just thank God for his great life and that I had a chance to spend about 35 years of my life closely involved with him. He's in a better place, we all know that, but we still are selfish and would like to have him here with us now. But you know, at 84, it won't be long I'll be with him. I'll probably see him real soon. I look forward to it. I can't say enough of how wonderful a man and what a great minister of the gospel, one of the generals, one of the champions of the faith, Dr. Morris Cirillo. I owe so much to him and I thank you. I thank you for sharing him with the world. God bless each one of you.